Hey everybody, Coach Carly here. Um, I, this is my second try of doing this video because I've got rubbish internet apparently, so hopefully this one goes through. Um, Squishy is here as always. Say hello, Squishy. She's looked very not impressed today. I think she's uh, maybe not feeling that well. I tried to take her for a walk at the park this morning and literally we got to the end of the road before when she was literally dragging her. So I just took her home because she wasn't feeling it today. Um, so... I just wanted to check in today because we are 20 sleeps away from the end of 2022. I know a lot of you will be uh, are quite happy to see the back end of it. Um, I've had a great year. Uh, it's been an interesting year, but a really good one. But I know a lot of people have not been feeling this year at all. Um, so hopefully 2023 is better for you. Um, but this is a really good time of year to pause and reflect on your year that you've had. Have you achieved your goals that you set? Did you achieve any goals this year? Um, COVID has kind of thrown a spanner in the works the last couple of years. So I think people are just happy to, I don't know, have a year maybe. Um, but yeah, I at, during this time of year, what I do with my coaching clients is I like to have a bit of a reset session with them. So we look at what have they achieved this year? What want, What do they want to achieve that they haven't? Um, you know, is there anything that they need to forgive, heal, release, move on from um, at the end of the year, at the end of 2022, uh, before they move into 2023 with a fresh energy, right? And what kind of goals do they want to create for themselves next year? So um, normally I offer that as two separate coaching sessions, but actually this year I want to tweak it. So what I'm going to offer is a two hour long two hours two hour sessions so a coaching session and a healing session um whether it's in person or distant doesn't matter and they can either be done together or separately again that doesn't matter but the coaching session is very much going to focus on what did you create this year what did you not what did you have happen that you didn't want to happen and what do you need to heal and release hey dylan how you going um what do you need to heal and release from this year uh, and then really using that to create and fuel your goals for 2023. I don't know about you, but I I have a massive 2023 plan. So I need to get my ass into gear, get my support team around me, have my accountability buddies and really just get excited about next year. Um, but, you know, often there's some things that you need to release, like limiting beliefs and past baggage and all that kind of stuff that might be getting in the way of you creating that greatness for yourself next year. But you also need to re get really, really clear on what you want to achieve next year, right? Some people don't know. Some people just coast through life and just kind of wait for things to happen. I prefer to be a bit more action oriented than that and really have the year that I want to have and really get clear on what that year is that I want to have. I'm really, really, really clear on what kind of 2023 I want to have. And Squishy's butt for you all. <laughs> She's funny. Um, so, yeah, so these sessions, it will be a coaching session that will be dedicated to <coughs> kind of wrapping up 2022 sussing out what you want to create in your 2023 and then followed by an energy treatment where we really kind of bring up any shit that you've accumulated from this year that needs to be healed and released from your energy field before you can step into the energy of 2023 so that you kind of start your year with a bang um if you're interested in that let me know drop a comment send me a message go on to coachcarly.com send me a message on there send me a message on my Facebook page, send me a PM, whatever you want to do. However you want to contact me is totally fine. Um, but let's get talking. I really want to get excited with as many people as possible for what they're going to create in 2023. Don't just sit there and think, oh God, I hope next year is not as bad as this year was. Fuck that kind of thinking. Like create your reality. You can make it happen. Yes, life throws curveballs all the time, but you can, you know, you can love the dog code bombing <laughs> she's always doing that she's always right next to me she's the best little buddy ever um it's really bad though when she drops a fart and then just walks off like she quite often does i feel video bombing yeah she's gonna be fart bombing me in a minute i can i can feel it in the air dylan <laughs> um yeah but i still love her for it um so yeah you know all good totally fine you haven't interrupted um 
Yeah, so like, how do you want your 2023 to be? Don't just wait for life to happen to you. Engineer it so that you create your reality and then deal with any of the curveballs and plot twists that life throws your way, as it always will, right? Um, but, you know, like I'm sat here in Australia as a citizen living near the beach with my amazing bulldog in the best, most amazing relationship with a gorgeous fiance doing my dream work. And I've engineered all of that. I have been the creator of my reality. It didn't just fucking happen, right? I made it all happen. Make your life happen for yourself. But you've got to get really, really clear on how you want it to be. And sometimes you need a cheerleader and someone to be accountable to, to make or give you a kick up the ass when you're not doing it for yourself. Because, you know, how much of your time are you spending watching Netflix or just scrolling mindlessly on the Facebook newsfeed? None of that stuff is going to contribute to you having the best 2023 that you could possibly have. None of it is going to contribute to you being the best version, most authentic version of yourself that you could possibly be. None of that is going to contribute to you having amazing relationships or an amazing bank account or the kind of dream career that you want, you know? Yes, it's a restful relaxation space to be in, but are you doing it too much? Could you be using some of that time to get focused on your goals and how you really, really want to create your next year? Um, so yeah, just uh, dropping in to say hello. Hadn't planned a live, but felt really, really buzzy after doing Reiki One today and just wanted to pop in and say hello to everyone. Um, I love, I'm getting to love doing live videos. So hope you enjoyed watching. Hope that has given you some food for thought. And if you want any help with anything whatsoever, but especially creating your game plan for 2023, then drop me a message and let me know. Um, it's only it's only Monday. I can't believe it's only Monday. I feel like it's a weekend. Um, enjoy the rest of your week, whatever you're doing, wherever you are in the world, and whatever the weather is doing your way. Lots of love to you all. Bye.